We did it, CJ. Let's bail back to Grove Street. So welcome back to San Andreas and the walkthrough. This is um, just finishing off this mission. So. It looks like I've got our tag over there. Yeah, that's where we found it. So I normally not so bothered with that me gang back, but I might as well let these guys in. They saved me well. So uh, yeah, the last uh, gang territory in the tip is a lot easier than the first. It really isn't a difficult mission, I think I just made it so the first time, the second time I was in the pool, so we get more But I think there's the follow-up mission, I think there's going to be another one that's sort of very similar. Yo, this is the 5L2, Yep, Grove C family handling those balls. Johnson boys rolled right over. Okay, dog. I'm gonna get some sleep. I'm beat. Here, I took this from one of those baller fools. Probably drug money. Here's your half. Trying to check me? So uh, that's the last of Stay sweet finale. Right, I must admit, I thought you could carry on until sort of his last mission. Um, cause there are still a couple more sweet ones before the last one. Um, you know, I forget. I think I might just do another few more gang walks. As soon as I got my grove gone, as soon as they die, I'll head to CJ. But, um, you yeah, know, I'm just thinking the next mission is actually quite long, Chase, so. <coughs> probably done for the night after this episode, and I don't think. It will actually uh, sort of end in this within this episode and carry on to a new one. So I'm just gonna take out a few gang wars, probably head and buy that apartment. And I'm pretty much done for the night. Then uh, yeah, so pretty much soon after this, um, I will have to go and do them tags. Because I've been saying I'll do. What you do <coughs> so I'll just check how much. Right. With 500 spray can. I'll uh, I'll end up finishing the save file, whether that be off cam or tonight. Uh, I'll end up finishing that by Grove Street. Hey, Here's way. an example I was talking about earlier where the people can run away. Cold. Don't know where back now, but you can see they went around that corner then. And I couldn't actually finish you can't see us, the wait. Uh, if you spend too much time outside, Homies, over here. the actual gang wall area just going red, then you actually fail it. So it can be annoying when it happens. It's, it's worse than a couple of gang wall territories that are notorious for it, so I might actually end up pointing them out if I do do it uh, on camp rather than off camp. What y'all waiting for? Doing my job for the hood. I'll try telling them to follow me. And the gang's at it. So it's all pretty routine and simple when you have like the weapon skill I've got right now and the AK and stuff. These are the only slightly difficult ones. I'm getting crossfired a bit now. Huh? Yeah, no problem. You think I got issues? Gotta 
gun in your face, huh? Wow, I was doubting my respect when it was in. Yeah, less of turrets, given the size of the game, you know. I've probably gained more respect on this in the last uh, two hours than I have in probably the previous 15. And amongst all that, you know, I've pretty much taken over San Fierro and Las Venturas, so... And it just goes to show, you mainly gain it on Los Santos. And largely by a byproduct of doing this, just uh, shooting out a lot of balls. So, we'll move on to Vagos soon. But for now, we will like to get rid of their territory, just because uh, they're a bit more hostile gang towards me. Take that paper. Don't need this no more. Huh. I never considered that as a tactic. <laughs> I have two way to do that. Just rushing them and getting them in the speed. You have that many. Give me that. Bullets, so you actually can do that fairly effectively. So, yeah, I wouldn't deter you from doing that. Uh, if you do have high weapon skill with it, whatever this is, I think it's a Tech 9. Then it's certainly feasible. I mean, hopefully, you just roam around there as well. I might come across a few like uh, tags, get them out of the way. So that's annoying. Hood have literally just taken over his from the attack, so I can use this and yeah, sorry as an example of how to defend it. I think they only come with one wave, but they're pretty much all there when you turn up. And they're all heavily armed, so it's like a bit of a blitzkrieg guitar. Actually, shotguns on this as well. Sometimes I find. Yeah, you saw one of them then, and um, they never usually have shotguns on the actual gang got. attacks. So I don't know why these guys are at my table. Put these up. No, but he helps pretty decent right now. I do need some practice in the police chili I challenge and the BMX challenge is another side mission I've got to do. Unfortunately, I couldn't finish the last mission within the last episode, so uh, apologies if it's slightly repetitive of me just killing these guys. But um, it is needed, I suppose, I can argue that. Uh, said, you do need 30% control to trigger the final mission, which I don't have open just yet, but of course um, I will do really soon. But as I said, I would like to get 100%. Um, it just seems more complete then. So if I have anything like the glitch, the infamous glitch I mentioned when I was doing the boat school, uh, where like a territory actually turned up in the boat school, you know, it looked like I had 
Yeah, I had 100 percent sorry, but I actually had 99 and it was actually a tiny little territory there. That's really weird. But uh, yeah, if anything out of the ordinary happens from beyond this point, then I'll of course uh, make sure to record it and stuff. So uh, yeah, most of these will be off camera. And uh, I hope we do get 100 percent but as I've mentioned, some of them are difficult just to even start the war and uh, some of the Vagos in particular these ones up in these roads this road's a big hill so they always seem to like run down there and run off this way and uh, you know you sort of need a sniper to do that one I'd say yes. I'll try and have them do one of them actually show, show what I mean so I can't wait to do oh, okay. Now these guys, they always seem a bit harder, the Vagos ones, so a bit more uh, sort of armoured up and stuff. This one's the really hard one to even start it in as well. Jefferson knows that you're sort of raw bolus over here to this tiny little area. These ones can be a bit annoying because it's like the, the area of the actual walls are so thin because they're sort of like strips like that. So you will have these guys sort of run up the hill, but some of them do start running down it like they are now. And that's what I mean, it's just really annoying these. you got to get them before they get too far because they'll kill down, down that way. And I'll sort of get penalised for being outside the wall area if um, I spend too long outside it. But obviously if they go the other way and get too far away then I can't kill them to end the first wave. So I do definitely think I should have sorted these in like blocks that are um, horizontal rather than vertical. I haven't had the worst example of it yet, where they sort of run off. And I think it might well be the other strip, so I've been fairly lucky so far. And of course it is more of a tough to get the ones at the back first. So I suppose I've done that kind of well, but um, it's going to take this one. So box off little areas, if you can. So actually my, uh, my video will probably run out by the time I get it, so I'm going to carry on getting through these stuff. Okay. Um, yeah, next time I cut to it, I'm going to be taking down a few side missions. Most likely will be probably tagged. So I'll catch you guys then.